Hi there, my name is Gethin Hodges, I'm a third year medical student. I've been asked today to perform an examination of your brain functioning. Basically this involved me asking you a few questions. Um, doing a few tests on your eyes, um, shining the light, and getting you to perform some other uh, tests. Might appear a bit bizarre, but just bear with me. Um, it wouldn't be painful at all. Would that be okay? That's fine. Excellent. So just to begin with, can I ask you, have you noticed any changes in your sense of taste or smell recently? No. Okay, so could you tell the difference between strong flavours like coffee and banana? Yeah. Excellent. And I see you're wearing glasses. Do you normally wear those? Yeah, I always wear glasses. Okay. Have you had any problems with your vision at all recently? No, recently no. Okay. Um, what I'd like to do is if you just cover up your right eye, and I've got a chart over here on the wall. Okay. Could you just try and read the lowest line you can read there? Yeah, it's X O A T E H U Y. Okay, and with the other eye as well? X O A T E H U Y. Okay, that's great. So that's 6.5 vision in both eyes. And next, what I'd like you to do is if you just look across my shoulder and focus on the distance, and then look very quickly at my finger. Okay, excellent. And again, in the distance. Okay, so testing for accommodation, and that's normal. That's good. What I'd like to do now is if you look straight ahead at me, um, I'm just going to wiggle my fingers on the outside and just look straight at me. Just tell me which side you can see my fingers moving. Okay. Both sides. Okay. That side. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Excellent. Okay. Um, what I'd like to do now is if you can cover up your right eye. And what I'd like to do, you'll see my finger on the outside as I bring it in towards. Just tell me where you can first see my finger. Okay. Yep. 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 Okay, and the other eye? Yep. Now this time you'll see a coloured pin. Okay. Um, it'll appear grey on the outside, but as it comes in closer and closer, it'll appear red. Just tell me when it becomes red. Okay. So if you just cover up your right eye again. Good. Looks red. Yep. 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 Good. Let's check out the other eye as well. So you can just take off your glasses. Now I'm just going to shine the light in your in your eye. So just look straight at me. So I'm just testing for direct and consensual response. Consensual. And that's normal in both eyes. And I'm just going to do a swing test as well. Okay, that's great. Thank you. Um, I'm just going to have a look at the backs of your eyes with this device. So you just look, um, just at a point in the distance, you can just focus. I'm just going to place my hand, I'm going to be getting quite close to you That's for this. Fine. It's just, it won't take too long. Okay, that right. so just come around this side as well. So there's no signs of papilledema in the eyes as well. That's great. Um, what I'd like to do now is I'm just going to check your eye movements. Um, so if you put your glasses back on for this. And what I'd like to do is just focus on my finger. Mm -hmm. And just tell me if you see any double vision at any time. Okay. So I'm looking for any signs of nice segments at the extremities as well. No signs of any double vision? No. Okay, so that's all good. Excellent. Uh, so that's um, three, four, and six tested. Uh, okay, I'm just going to wash my hands. Okay, so next I'm just going to place this cotton wool. I'm just going to show you what this feels like just by touching your chest there. Okay, you feel that? Yeah. Okay, I'm just going to move your hair out of the way. I'm just going to touch you on the side. You close your eyes for this. Can you feel what that feels like? Yeah. Can you feel that? Yeah. Feel the same? Yeah, yes. Okay, can you feel that? Yep. Can you feel that? That's the same. Same? Feel that? Yep. Feel that? That's the same. Same? Excellent. 
I'm just going to place my hands on your jaw. So can you just clench down for me? Good. Relax. And clench again. Okay. I'm just going to place my hand on your chin. Try and open. Stop me from moving. Good. Excellent. Can you just move your jaw from side to side? Okay. That's great. Um, I can also test for corneal reflex, um, but I'm not going to do that now. Um, so next, okay, what I'm going to do is basically I'm just going to do some movements for you and I'd like you to just copy them. So if you could just raise your eyebrows up for me, good, and just clench your eyes really tight. Okay, I'm just going to place my hands, try to stop me from opening them. Okay, excellent. And can you puff out your cheeks? Okay, and can you show me your teeth? Excellent, okay, good. Um, what I'd like to do now is I'm just going to whisper something to your ear and I'd just like you to tell me what you can hear. Okay. A, B, C. Good. One, two, three. Excellent. Good. And um, now what I'd like you to do is if you could just put up your arms like this for me, by your side. Okay, and stop me from moving you. Excellent. Good. And look over your right shoulder. I'm just going to place my hand on your cheek and look back towards me if you can. Okay, excellent. Just testing the right. That's doing quite a mastoid. And look over your left shoulder and turn back to face me. Excellent. So there's good strength there. That's fine. Um, next, what I'd like you to do is, could you just say R for me? Ah. So looking for any signs of uvula deviation, um, we should deviate um, away from the lesion. And that's not present. Um, could you just take a sip of water for me? Okay, and just swallow for me. Okay, can you cough? <coughs> okay, excellent. Um, I could also consider gag reflex at this time, but I'm not going to do that here. Um, so just to finish off with then, if you could just uh, stick out your tongue for me. Okay, so I'm noting any fasciculations uh, which are not present, and I'd also notice um, that the tongue might deviate towards the side of lesion, and that's fine. Thank you very much. Okay, that concludes my examination. I'm just going to wash my hands and report my findings, and um, put your glasses back on as well, that's great. Um, so in conclusion, um, we've tested all 12 cranial nerves and there's no anomalies detected in this patient. Um, visual acuity was 6.5 in both eyes. Thank you very much.